So hello everyone, this is Paras Patidar from MIT. So today we will learn how to upload a Jupyter notebook on your GitHub profile. So GitHub repository, you can say. So first open your GitHub. Like I open my GitHub, then you can go to this plus sign, go to new repository. We create repository name like uh, I can say numpy I am giving the name numpy text like uh, I can give a description it consists of consists of Almost like all, almost all the codes, commands, you can say, soft numpy. And write this. Okay. And you can make this like public if you want to do private. You have to upgrade your account, like enterprise version. So you use public. Like you should initial good readme you can read the notes and like python 3 or python so here you click import, create repository okay so as soon as you click create repository it will the repository will be created and so here uh, is a readme file so here we have to upload a ipython file so upload this uh, file option upload files so go to upload files here drag or choose your files like mine is numpatrix from 0 to 0 this is the file I used like ipython notebook so you can use commit changes like new ipython the notebook added notebook added description leave it or you want to you can give it so you can come to master branch you can create a new branch for collaboration of different users so I'm committing to master branch and commit changes the file is processing this may take a few minutes like my file got added on my repository this is I open it you can see here Like file takes some time to configure, so it's loading. Yeah, the file got loaded. Yeah. So you got it. This how to upload this to IPython notebook or Jupyter notebook. On this, you can do with any notebook. Like Google Colab is also creating its own notebooks. Like in the form of IPython notebooks, you can also upload them. There's an option Google Colab like you can directly connect with github but in this you can use this also so this nb weaver also to connect this but this is the best part i see so i upload in this way so if any questions or any query please contact our team or give comment in the comment section box we are happy to solve your query so thank you guys and stay connected